Hi there, this is Catherine. Thanks you for listening to my SEO Tips micro podcast. So before we get into today's SEO tip, I just wanted to share with you the ways you can support the podcast if you're enjoying all the tips and finding them useful. So you can send me a donation at buymeacoffee.com slash Catherine W. Ong, O-N-G. And that's Catherine with a K. Any and all levels of donation are appreciated. It will help me offset the cost of producing the podcast. So that's buymeacoffee.com slash K-A-T-H-E-R-I-N-E-W-O-N-G. I'd also encourage you to subscribe to our email list to make sure you're not missing any future episodes or any other news about the SEO Tips podcast. And to do that, you'd go to wostrategies.com slash newsletter. Okay, on with today's tip. Let's talk about the new tools inside Google Search Console and Big Webmaster Tools and why you would want to use them. Hello, and thanks for listening to SEO Tips today. There's a new version of the crawl report in Google Search Console. Google's released a crawl stats report, and the latest report shows the number of requests grouped by response code, crawled by file type, crawl purpose, and Googlebot. And by the way, this report is actually kind of hidden. I've got a link on... Um, my website that goes along with this uh, SEO tip, but you can't find this report inside the navigation. Don't ask me why, but it's the most helpful information because it shows you Googlebot recently crawled, how many 404s it found, um, whether or not it uh, had trouble with your host, uh, examples of URLs where your site requests occurred, um, stuff you would normally find in your log files that you might have to request from a developer. That stuff is now inside Google Search Console. Super helpful. Um, you can learn more on the Google's developer site or visit my website where I've got a little bit more information about it. Google has also finally migrated the disavow link tool to the new Google Search Console. So you can now download and see any errors in your disavow file inside the new interface. And over to Bing, Microsoft Clarity is now free to use inside Bing Webmaster Tools. Free, a free heat map tool. You just need to add the code to your website. So anyway, those are your new resources for this week. The disavow tool in Google Search Console, all this great log file sort of analysis inside Google Search Console, and the Microsoft Clarity heat map tool inside Bing Webmaster Tools. Thanks for listening. Come back tomorrow for another SEO tip.